guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited today I get to share with you my life update video. I've been waiting to film this video for like a month now. A lot of fun, exciting, and new things happening in 2016 and I'm really excited to share that with you guys. So I really wanted to do a face-to-face -face video. It's been a while since I did this type of video and I just wanted to sit down and spend some time with you guys explaining what I've been up to and what's going on and what's to come. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get started. So the first thing I guess I'll talk about is my green hair. Um, I finally got the color I wanted. If you follow me on Instagram, I dyed my hair back in September. Turquoise green color, especially when it faded and it was like a really blue turquoise. I didn't really like it. I mean, I liked it. It looked nice, but it wasn't the color I wanted. I wasn't enjoying that hair color. So once that was fading, I went back and I did my hair and it's a dark green. It's like a hunter green, which is what I wanted. So yay, I'm so excited. I love it so much. It's really pretty. It kind of looks like a natural color. Um, it's not really out there. That's what I wanted. I was going for a dark green because I didn't want a vibrant um, in your face color I wanted something more natural looking because um, it really does look like a natural color even though it's a green color it looks like a dark hair color and it looks really cool also as you guys probably know by now I made it onto the Tombow design team for 2016 and I'm so happy and grateful and excited um, that they picked me for 16 finalists and they picked four new design team members and I'm so grateful and honored to be one of the four. I'm really excited and I can't wait to share with you guys the fun projects I have coming up with Tombow for this year. It's a great company and I'm not just saying that, like I honestly love them and I'm really happy that I was able to make it on their team and support them and share with you guys this amazing company that I love and uh, hopefully you guys can try out some of their products as well and if you do give them a shot you know let me know leave me a comment or instagram me or something i'd love to hear your thoughts on it and i'm telling you you're gonna love it they're really good yesterday i actually shared my very first post for tombow um we do instagram posts and blog posts and so our first um theme was to share your th top three favorite products from Tombow and um, if you guys are interested in knowing my top three favorite products and the ones I recommend all the time check out my Instagram the link will be posted down below but it's basically at Ceres B S-E-R-E-S-B-E-E -E -E. and yeah check it out so you guys can see which three products are my favorite so I work at Michael's and um, in December I got this crazy amazing opportunity to work with um, our creative ambassador on a wedding event. It's just such an amazing opportunity. I had a lot of fun working on it. That's why I was really busy in December. I didn't really make that many videos or have any craft tutorials for Christmas projects. I didn't even you know, share December daily stuff because I've just been so busy working on that. The wedding event, um, we came up with three different um, wedding themes. And I was in charge of coming up with the theme and designing all the, you know, creating all the products to put on the display table. And so the theme I went with, you know, I wanted to represent my style. I wanted something edgy and new, something modern. So I came up with the theme geometric metallics. Geometric shapes are really popular right now and I love them. They're really cool. And the colors and stuff that I, go I went with were black, gold, silver, you know, metallic colors. So I really had a lot of fun with that theme. I'm really proud of it. I'm sorry I didn't get to film any of that. I really did want to film the process and, you know, show you the finished products and everything. But, you know, just time was limited and I didn't get a chance to film it. But what I am planning on doing is maybe like a sort of vlog of the event itself. I'm definitely going to film the table when it's all presented nicely. And um, I'll share all that with you guys. Maybe do a little mini video on that so you guys can see what I made. basically created geometric shapes using paper straws and wire. So I made this huge diamond for the centerpiece, I made another shape for the table number, and then another little shape, and then I made a bunch of other little things here and there. So I'll definitely share all of that soon. Uh, the event is actually this weekend, so the same weekend as CHA, and so I'm going to be there, and I'm really stressing out about it and nervous because there's going to be a lot of people, and I'm going to be at the booth, you know, explaining how I did the projects and stuff like that. The really cool thing is that our projects, what our themes are going to be shown on TV in our local um, news sort of station. They're doing a little special for wedding themes and it's going to be airing Saturday, but I'll have the video up by next Wednesday. So I'm going to be able to share that with you guys. It's going to be in French because I do live in Quebec, Canada, so um, it's a French local station. It's really cool because she's going to show all the projects we made and like my 
creations are going to be on TV, which is pretty cool, and I'm really excited about that. So that's just something really exciting that I wanted to share with you guys. Backtracking to Tombo and CHA, I made projects for Tombo, and those projects will be up on the Tombo CHA booth, which is like crazy. You guys know by now that I used to do like CHA covers. I'm like in love with CHA and it's so much fun every year. I look forward to it. And it's one of my dreams to go attend a CHA show. And I have a lot of people that are going this year and I'm so excited for them. I can't wait to like follow them on Instagram and Facebook and see what they post. I'm so excited about that. My dream is to go to CHA and hopefully one day, fingers crossed, I'll be able to go. But the cool thing is, my projects are going to be there, so things I physically touched and made with my own hands are going to be at CHA this year. And my party hat banner that I made as my design team finalist project is going to be up. And they're also going to have photos of the design team up in the booth. So my face and my projects are going to be at CHA 2016, which is so cool. And I really hope that you know someone can show me a picture and share it with me because I'm so excited and I'm definitely going to like document that. I'm so honored and excited that I was able to participate in this year's CHA thanks to Tombo. So that's something that I would have never been able to do if it wasn't for them and I'm so grateful for that. So thank you so much. I'm so excited. And if you guys are going to CHA this year, don't forget to check out the Tombo booth and look at all the products that we sell and look at all the projects we made. Maybe like take a selfie with my picture or um, the pro the things I made, that'd be really cool if you guys could like take a selfie with that and show me because oh my god, I died. And last but definitely not least, something huge is happening in my life. I am moving out. Oh my god, I can't believe I just said that. It's happening. It's gonna be a crazy transition for me, um, but it's time that I move out. I've been with my boyfriend for a really, really long time, like a decade exactly. And so that's just the next step that we need to take in our relationship to live together. We're not ready for marriage or anything like that, but it just feels right. And the opportunity presented itself, so we had to take it. Um, his parents redid the basement into a bachelor, like a studio sort of apartment. So the opportunity was perfect and it was just there and we're like, you know what, let's just try this out. So we've been kind of going back and forth with the idea for a month and then it's finalized. Yeah, that's really exciting because what that means is I'm gonna have a legit craft space with a legit craft table and I'm gonna be able to make legit videos. I'm telling you like filming right now is the hardest thing in my house. There's always someone home and I'm shy. Like I don't wanna film with someone listening to me, which um, I kind of have to get over because my brother's upstairs and he could probably hear everything and I'm like, oh my gosh, but anyway. I have to find the perfect place to film these sort of videos like right now I'm propped up on my couch in front of my Christmas tree because this is like the best lighting I can find but now that I have my own space I can film anywhere I want and I'm just so excited I'm gonna be able to do more face-to-face -face videos so the content on my channel is gonna change I'm gonna have more professional looking videos for you guys I'm really excited about that because I get to grow my YouTube channel because of this awesome opportunity. I'm gonna have better videos, better quality, just a lot more DIY stuff and I'm just so excited. Like I'm really excited for that. And with that, I get to do crafty organizational videos. I'm so excited because I get to show you guys my actual craft space and how I organize everything and all the fun things I bought to organize my products. I'm just so excited. So not only am I moving out, which is a crazy experience, eventually gonna be able to give you a house tour, a room tour, a craft room tour, a freaking organizational tour, and like just those type of vlogs and videos. I'm so excited about that. So all of those people who've been wanting something like that for me, I'm gonna be able to finally film videos like that for you. I'm thinking of doing like an organizational video series. Because this is all new to me, I definitely want to document all of it and have you guys come along with me and how I decorate and everything and how I organize my stuff, my crafty stuff. So that's exciting. And um, so definitely look out for more organizational home video or home decor videos on my channel. Hope you guys don't mind that because I really love those type of videos. I'm finally got my own space. I can finally host Halloween parties and have my friends over for game nights. And I'm just so excited. Yeah. If you guys have any tips on moving out for the first time and living with a boy for the first time, I'd love to hear that. Um, it's definitely going to be scary. My dad doesn't even think it's happening, but like he's kind of in denial. He keeps saying that the only time he'll let me move out is when I'm 36, and I'm like, no, never going to happen. Um, so I've already started buying some things, and unfortunately I don't have them here to make a haul video for you guys, but I am posting it on Instagram. 
So if you guys want to see the items I've been picking up for my new place, I can't believe I just said that. <laughs> oh my gosh. So if you guys want to see the items I've been picking up for my new place, definitely check out my Instagram. I post it all the time. I actually posted a picture yesterday of a small Ikea haul. Yesterday I went to Ikea with hopes of buying my craft table, but then you know, Ikea makes it complicated. There's so many different things you can do, so um, I'm still not sure what I'm going to do yet. So I just bought a bunch of little things for my room and this amazing black and white plate and black and white blanket. So if you guys want to check it out, my Instagram is Series B and the link will be posted down below as well. I'm bringing everything there slowly, slowly, so everything that I'm buying stays there. Check out my Instagram for the items that I recently purchased for my new place. And what else is there to say? Um, I am moving in February, so next month. Please be patient with me if I don't make videos for the next month or if I'm just really behind. Um, you guys know why. Wedding event, tombow projects, and I'm moving out all at the same time. So that's crazy. But it's really exciting because 2016 started off in a great way. Um, I'm going to learn independence. I'm going to learn how to make food and cook for myself. Um, yeah, I'm ready for it. I'm really scared. I was really scared actually. I was a lot more scared than I am now. Now I'm just like ready for it. I want my own space. I want to be able to sleep in when I want to sleep in. I think I'm going to end this video here. It's long enough. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope you guys are going to be patient with me. And I hope you are excited as well. Because like I said, I'm going to have some fun new videos for you guys. That I wasn't able to do before. So yeah. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And join me with my new journey. Thank you so much and have a great day. Bye.